Okay, so these are Dixie's puppies. They turned four weeks old. It's past Wednesday, so today's Saturday. And we just put different color collars on them just now, so we're still trying to figure out who's who. Um, we always just kind of have, usually we say between four and a half and five and a half weeks to pick the pups. We usually just watch to see how they're acting because there's kind of a certain age period where all of a sudden they sort of pop out of their shells and start getting excited and you see their personalities and they really have not hit that yet I think they're right on the brink but they haven't yet so start to think about who you'd be interested in like if anybody kind of kind of pops out to you you know pay attention to that but I'm not gonna have you try to pick until they're ready to be picked because you'll see them in a couple weeks and then you might have a different opinion when they actually are acting different but just start thinking about that we've got the five girls this is one and then these four are the other girls. I'll put her back here. Oops. Are you on my point? Yeah. So this is purple, purple female. And then this is orange female. And this is the runt, the, I don't know what we're calling it, white and blue. White the, and the bright. Uh, yeah, we'll call it blue or okay. blue and white. Blue and white female, she's the run. And here's our pink female. And here's our blue and orange female. She's like, ah. Oh. Alright. Okay, so, so we've got purple, orange, blue and white. Blue and white, pink, and blue and orange. So then the boys are here, the four boys. Okay, so here is black on my right and then green on my left. Black, black and green. <laughs> and then here is, I guess we'll call this blue and cheetah. Blue and cheetah. And then if you want to do size-wise, I would say black's probably the smallest, but not, not by very much. Yeah, he's a little bit more They're of a petite all size. Similar size. To me, blue and... These guys are the biggest, probably who's cheetah. cheetah. Blue and cheetah um, are on the bigger side. And on the bigger side over here, I would say probably the girls. purple is probably the biggest. Yeah. And maybe, maybe blue and orange and pink, and then and then and orange and we'll just. Go and then back. orange is in between, and then blue I would say is the so, runt. Yeah, she's definitely. But with size, that's one of those things that is so unpredictable. I've had people. Well, I've bought two sister dogs before, Roxy and Lily. They were the two biggest in the litter. And the exact same size until about nine months and then one stopped growing and the other kept growing and so it's and I've had people with runs that end up normal size I've had people with runs that always stay small it's that's kind of hard to predict but obviously if you're picking the runt you're gonna probably your odds are pretty good it's gonna be smaller and I you know if you're picking the bigger one your odds are in that favor so if size matters to you then obviously that's your best bet but um, seems like purple at this point is the first one to start kind of coming out to meet you. Usually, the way that this works with their personalities is that every puppy, it just kind of happens at some point that they start becoming kind of what you would identify as a playful puppy. And some of them that comes earlier, and that's why they're the first one, like maybe purple, to start walking out to you and some of them if they're going to end up being the most like energetic outgoing one then they're the first one to start showing that so like purple could end up always being the most outgoing or she might just be a little bit ahead of everybody else and start to be exploring around already so if that makes any sense but um at this point she's kind of the only one to really catch my eye with that um and that'll come out more in the next couple days to a week here. <laughs> Let's. Can you just point out who's who yeah. again? And... So, orange female. We'll just put her up here. And then here's our blue female. And then here is our pink female. And then here is our black male. And then here's purple female. And then here is a uh, blue and orange male. Oh, sorry, female. And then green male. And then blue male. And then our cheetah male. And there they are. Okay. 
So over this next week, I usually try to get, um, once their personalities kind of pop, like a couple videos for you to start picking. Um, and usually at that point, I tell everybody, like, if you're number three to pick, try to pick out your number one, your number two, and your number three choice so that you're kind of thinking that way so that once the people ahead of you pick, you're kind of prepared. So you can kind of keep that in the back of your mind. We're not to that point yet, these guys. But kind of if anybody starts calling out to you, kind of take note of that and um, keep that in mind. And just point out again, you don't have to move them, just point. Uh, cheetah male, green male, blue male, uh, blue and orange female, orange female, or blue female. And this would be our purple male. Female. Female. Sorry, purple female. And then pink female. She's and zonked. Here is our black male. Yeah. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Yeah. So they're still at the point where they're just exploring the world and trying to figure out how everything works. Who's crying back there? Pink? Pink female. So I will have more videos for you next week, and I'm guessing probably the next time I take it, they'll probably be ready to start picking. Um, and so we'll have more details then. But so hopefully this kind of starts to get you thinking. I'll go over each of their faces one more time, and then we'll, we'll be done. Black male. Okay. Purple female. Okay. Uh, blue female. Right. Yeah. And then here's our pink female back here. <laughs> and then this is orange female. Okay. Blue and orange male. I'm sorry, female. Why do I keep calling her male? Because last time female. she was oh, male. Okay. All right. Blue male. Green male. And then cheetah male. All right. So there we go. Thank <laughs> you.